So here we go, Kurt. We'll continue on with wrapping up 2007. You and Nash uh, are going to build to this tag match, and you're at odds, and the assumption is that Scott Hall is going to be Sting's partner, and it'll be a swerve on you. But were you excited about the possibility of Scott Hall coming in? Oh, yeah. Scott was a great talent. I watched a lot of video of him in WCW and WWE when he wrestled Shawn Michaels in that ladder match. I knew he was a very gifted athlete, and uh, I wanted to, I wanted to try a piece of Sh- Scott Hall. I was really excited about it, but unfortunately, that didn't happen. Uh, they had a funny segment that aired around this time too, where you put an ankle lock on a sting dummy uh, that fell from the ceiling. I'm, I'm sure you enjoyed that, did you? <laughs> oh, it was a blast, man! I had so much fun doing that. <laughs> Well, listen to Genesis. You defend the title in the tag match with Booker T debuting and the observer had this to say, Kurt Angle would retain the TNA title by winning the fall, pinning sting, uh, and angle and Kevin Nash win over sting and Booker T in 13 minutes, 41 seconds. The tone of the match was set when angle had sting pinned, but Nash made the save for sting since whomever got the pinfall was champion. And it actually made sense. I mean, the match made zero sense, but what Nash did, given the no sense match made, made sense. Uh, Angle Angle went for the Olympic slam, but Sting turned it into a DDT. He continues to talk through the match, but uh, he gave it two and a quarter stars. And uh, he said so much interference, lots of gaga again, Kurt. But why do you think, because we were starting to see some clean finishes just a few months ago, but here we go. There's, There's a shift again, more to this interference stuff. Honestly, I'll tell you why, because I stood up and I won clean finishes when I wrestled those three matches. And after that, I didn't stand up anymore because it wasn't my fight to win. Uh, for some reason, TNA won a lot of interference in a lot of their matches. And I just didn't think it was, it was, uh, worth it. I thought, you know, this is not a way to build up talent and make talent. And I thought that, uh, you know, less interference was better. <laughs> 